delicious, but every turkey needs a great sidekick. And here with his three perfect picks is Chef Stefano Fife. <laughs> The turkey and I have the perfect sidekick. <laughs> no, no. Okay, so um, yeah, uh, every turkey needs some really good sides. Lots of sides. Lots of sides. Yes. Sometimes we uh, have trouble, you know, uh, thinking of what we're gonna serve with our turkey. Mm -hmm. So I'm trying to make it easy for everybody this year. Good. Okay. Yeah. So we're gonna make. We're gonna start with this beautiful salad. This looks so good. It's got so yes. much color in it. It's got. It's got everything you yeah. need. Roy saying, "Eat the rainbow." So this tastes you good, got it looks it. good. So basically, we have a little bit of baby kale, mm. um, and we just mixed it up with a little bit of clementines. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> we have a little bit of, you know, some of these daikon uh, radish shoots, if you want. And beautiful uh, purple. A little bit of pomegranate, nice. this and that. And the dressing, hazelnuts. So look, we can even yes. have some roasted hazelnuts with some hazelnuts, a little bit of crunch. Yeah, nice. And the dressing. Okay. Persimmons. Persimmons. I've never tried one. We find these uh, now. Yeah. Like this is the season. Um, come from Asia. Okay. What okay. does it taste like? Uh, I'll make you taste it. Because it looks it. like a it looks right. like a red pepper. So basically, what I do want to say is that you usually find this variety. It's an acorn variety type of thing, and yeah. um, you don't want to eat it when it's not ripe. Okay. So basically, a lot of people ask me the question sometimes. How do we know it's ripe, right? Yeah. So basically, when you touch it, look, you can touch it. It's like a little. It's oh, like it's soft. jelly a little bit. It's like you know, it's like a jelly yeah. under the skin type of thing, right? Okay. Or you can take the top and just like if it pulls out nice and easy, yeah, you're good. Oh, that looks like right. that's a way different texture than I so was expecting. So now, when we cut into it, oh. you see, guys, we get this. We can scoop it out. Uh, okay. We can scoop it out with a, with a spoon, or you can just like slice it, okay. and you can taste it. Okay, but am I supposed to eat that inside yeah, part? Yeah, eat it all. Uh huh. It's sweet. It's sweet, nice. No? It's nice and sweet. Yeah. And kind of fleshy. Kind of fleshy. I'm not gonna lie. No, not gonna lie. Kind I wasn't fleshy, expecting yeah. that because so, it looks like a red pepper. It, it does. But it's got more. It's it's yeah, nice it's and sweet. It's a little sweet. meaty. It's a little so meaty. Now, so that's yeah, it. A little meaty. So now what we want to do? What, what I did with this is that I I put a little bit of white balsamic vinegar, a little mm. bit of olive oil. I took like a few scoopfuls of that. I pureed it and I made mm. my dressing. Oh, that looks good. So this is gonna that's go good. right over the top of our salad. That looks nice amazing. Nice and sweet. Yeah. Yeah, that's gonna be amazing. So that's gonna, you know, a quick toss. Yeah. And we're good to go. Good stuff. Ka okay. The kale, I feel like it needs that. It yes. needs that it's a beautiful. Bit sweet. It's it needs gonna a little balance bit of it sweet. out. CityLine.tv for the recipes always. Um, and now we're gonna make another mm -hmm. side. Yeah, it's another veggie gratinato. Gratinato. So okay. basically, it's a gratin. Yeah. Uh, of zucchini and of tomato. As soon as okay. I hear cheese, I'm in. Uh, really? Yeah. yeah! I love cheese too. Yeah, I'm in. I mean, why not? Doesn't matter which it is. I don't invite people over if they don't like cheese. Right? <laughs> right. Just don't like, come. No, don't yeah, come. Don't come. <laughs> so, we, have, we sliced a bit of zucchini, we have some tomato. So, what we want to do here is we just want to layer them, right? Yeah. So, when I'm doing this, I don't know about you, but I'm a cook, right? And I always think of the the, I am not. the movie Ratatouille. <laughs> yeah. And I remember the little Ratatouille at the end of yeah. the movie where they, you know, it looks like this kind of gratin where you're layering all these nice vegetables together. So basically yeah. what you want to do at home is you're going to make yourself a bechamel. Mm -hmm. Okay, so equal parts flour, butter, add a little milk, make yes. your bechamel. You're going to put your bechamel on the bottom of a baking dish. Yep. And you're going to layer these guys after, you know, one at a time, zucchini, tomato, zucchini, tomato. Yeah. Yeah. Right? The this kids, is how the you kids make are going to love to do this as well. They will, but it's how you make it fun is you put it on a bed of bechamel. Exactly. Right? Now everything's looking better. Exactly. So, so now, that's lovely. When we do this, what we want to do is just grab a little bit of olive oil. So we're going to top it with olive oil. Okay, and then you want to make a topping, guys. So basically, what I did is I took grated parm, mm. a bit of panko, and some fresh thyme. Nice. So we just grab that, and we're just gonna put it right over the top, so you have like a bit of a this. Crust. Yes. Lovely. And you want to bake this guy yeah. at 320. Oh yeah. Oh. 325 yes. for about 30 minutes. Oh, to that's 35 it. minutes, yes. That is a and good you're gonna side get dish. something that looks like this. Okay, beautiful. Look at how that Look looks. Like so yeah, that looks good. Good. So, And finally, third side dish, really easy. Yes. A little bit of um, sauteed onions, so caramelized onions. So you take your onions, you cook them down nice and soft, you mm -hmm. roast a bit of tomatoes, cook some green beans, and just, you know, flip that all up. 
Nice. The great thing about all this is that this uh, holiday season, I partnered up with Pusateri's. Lovely. So I created a menu where you can get actually my whole menu in a box for eight people at home. Oh. Or you can get each individual dish yes. already ready where you just have to reheat it, right? So if you want to spend more time with your friends, you don't really have to do it. Right. But the recipes are going to be online on City TV. That's right. And um, yeah, and I mean, look at the digs. It looks very good. Right? So the fact that you can actually get that delivered. Yeah. Side, you just take a, you know, and look, I mean, turkey, well, sides. Good.